The damage has already been done, Avengers. Kamala, Tony, we're trying to restart the engines, but there's not enough power. We're out of time, people. Brace for impact. Hey, God of Thunder. Stay behind me. Now, bring it. Completely lost your senses. Ah, prodigal son returned. You almost obliterated all of Manhattan. Well, holier than thou, where were you while the world went to hell? Coming to terms with my failings, not making new. Ones. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Everyone, just take a breath. We planned on interrupting the AIM experience, showing the world what Carleton was up to. These adaptoids of his, they harvest their powers through the torture of these inhumans. They expose them to near lethal amounts of dark terrigen. And that is only step one. Georgie Boy is gearing up for a war. And what's worse is, Kamala here has found some evidence that might show what really happened to Steve. Hi. Every hero has to start somewhere. You remember me? No. Show me this footage. Jarvis? Are you done? I've broken the encryption, so there is more to see. George! We have to shut down the reactor! It's pulling us towards that heat signature. Uh, I've tried, but there's no way to disengage the crystal. Then get out. And seal the door. What? George, go. No. This can't be right. Head to the command deck. What? Evacuate now. No, 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 Cap. What are you doing? No, 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 no. Just stop. What are you doing? Smashed the reactor. He had to have a reason. What reason? Hundreds of people were infected. People died, Nat. Just take it easy. Don't you take some responsibility, Tony? Well, there's the Bruce I know. Throw everyone under the bus, why don't you? No, it's not the time. No, it's okay, Nat. See, he's been waiting to do this since Golden Acres, haven't you? Haven't you? This is our fault. All of ours. How do you not get that? It, what I get is that you actually believe all that crap you said at the hearing. I believe that we are dangerous. You really think the world is better without us? Yes. I'm out of here. You all have not changed. Look at her. She can't be fixed. She can't be cured. I've done the experiments. I've checked our DNA over and over and over again. You and I created the perfect disease. No, actually, I do the job. I make the tough decisions. Do it. I stand by the people who made me who I am. I am warning you. What's the matter, Bruce? Make you angry? <laughs> See, it's always been your problem. Run from who you are, what you are. Maybe that's why. Monica got the better of you. I was just agreeing with you, big guy. That banner is a coward. Guys, don't do this. This is exactly what Tarleton wants. I'd stay out of this one, kid.
Jarvis, I assume you can keep this thing in the air? For quite some time, yes. Oh, that's a relief. Without proof, there's no hope. But I can't just give up. This can't be how it ends. Jarvis, why can't I open this? I'm sorry, Miss Khan. Emergency lockdown is still in effect. I will need Mr. Stark's assistance to restore normal power. I can't believe I'm all alone in here. Hulk was going to smash the place up. A tragedy on the scale of A-Day was narrowly avoided over the skies of New York, thanks to the quick act. Jarvis, is there a recording of Bruce's interrogation of Monica? Certainly, miss. You can access it in the interrogation antechamber. If I may be so bold, Miss Khan, what do you hope to find in the interrogation footage? I don't know. I have to try something. Maybe she slipped up. Aim's the real enemy. I wish Bruce and Tony could see that. No offense, Jarvis, but I sure wish there was another person on board. None taken, Miss Khan. Interrogation footage. There's gotta be a clue here somewhere. Let me guess. You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. Come on, Monica, give me something. Scour the Earth. You will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the world requires sacrifice! Ugh, this is useless. I just want to talk to my dad. Calling Yusuf Khan. No, no, don't, Jarvis. I didn't mean to. Hello? Beta, is that you? Oh. oh, come on. If you're there, I miss you so much. Look, I'm not angry. I just want you to come home. I'm sorry. I should never have told you to hide your powers. Perhaps you're scared, a little unsure. I... The important thing is that you always stay true to yourself. I love you, Beta. I love you more. Avengers, if you can hear me, I think I found a clue. Look, I know I messed up. I wanted to blame AIM so bad for what happened to me on A-Day, it blinded me. But Cap 
must have had a good reason for what he did. I, I know it. People, people believe in the Avengers. Not just because of your cool powers, but, but because no matter how bad things get, no matter how much you disagree, you always come together. Don't you get it? Your differences are your greatest superpower. I was just some weird kid from Jersey who didn't fit in. But you saw me for who I really was. You accepted me. There's still a bad guy out there who wants to hurt the world. But we can stop him. Good isn't a thing you are. It's a thing you do. shouldn't have said that. I get it. Altitude, dry eyes. Look, I'm uh, not very good at... I'm sorry, so... Same. Good enough. Yep. So, you, uh... Found a clue? Yeah, it's the interview. Listen. Scour the earth. You will not find our lab. Okay. Monica's right. The lab's not on Earth. I'm not following. Okay, when I was captured, Monica and Tarleton had this argument. Tarleton had to leave the room, and then Monica pulled up the coordinates to this satellite called Ambrosia. Ambrosia? That was a S.H.I.E.L.D. biomedical research project. AIM must have required it during the takeover. It would be a great place to hide proof of inhuman experiments, right? If you wanted to study inhumans on the cellular level, then zero gravity would be a perfect place to do it. Good job. Okay, so, we know where we need to go. We just need a way to get there. Project Star Booster. As I recall, you abandoned it because you couldn't generate enough acceleration in the auxiliary rockets. Yeah, yeah, no need to bore everyone with the details. That was before I had access to Mr. Shrinky. Jarvis, get Pim on the phone. We need a way to get up to this space lab. He's the only one who can help. <laughs> 